<laughs> Josh just came. <laughs> Jesus. He's not okay. What's happening? It's, what? it's happening. What? <laughs> no. I... Is he going to start crying? Holy shit. I can't believe it. <laughs> yes. Uh, 1,742 days of waiting. <laughs> They're doing a memorial edition with Pirates and Ranger Key set. Hello, Tokusatsu community, and welcome back to the next episode of Project Unlock. And here we go, here we go. The moment of truth. So, this is the Memorial Mobirates from Tengo Kaiju, or I guess just Go Kaiju in general. The item that re kicked off the Ranger Key toy line. And today, I have the unboxing camera as usual, being my phone. I also have this camera going on right now to capture my facial reaction to this because this is a very, very important item to me. And there's been a lot of problems with this item. A lot of people have been receiving them with a lot of different uh, defects. There's been like this white powder stuff around the outside of it and like fingerprints on it and the keys not reading correctly. So I'm a little terrified to say the least. So uh, we're just gonna dive right into it here. It's been a crazy day. I got this box to unbox here and I got another big box of Revice stuff that just arrived. I also just got back from the doctor. I got my blood drawn. So it's been a day the day so let's open it here i'm so scared okay 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 <laughs> all right so <laughs> this is huge this is a huge box look at that memorial edition edition mobirates edition memorial all right here it is oh it's so pretty it's in the premium bandai shipper box that's how you know it's premium all right, so let's go ahead and dive into this one. So many boxes. So I pre-ordered this in June on the night that it first went up. I got in the first batch of this thing because I had to get it as soon as possible. As soon as I possibly could. Okay, so I don't care as much about this tissue paper. We can kind of just rip through that. I don't really care about the integrity of the tissue paper. Also, pardon this little cut on my hand. I apologize. <laughs> that might look bad on a video. I'm kind of just demonstrating with my hands here, but... Oh my gosh. <laughs> I've seen so many videos of it, but it's so pretty. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Gotta hold it up to the face cam. Look at, look at it. Uh, <laughs> the side has ranger keys on it. Uh, all right, so here it is, the Memorial Edition Mobirates. So we have this gorgeous shot of Gokai Red holding the phone. And as you might see on the side here, I have the original release Mobirates. I have the Legend Mobirates that came out 2011, 2012. And then I have the original Gokai Red Ranger Key back there. So very, very pretty box. It has this nice matte kind of finish to it. On this side, you get the Mobirates. It says Memorial Edition. On the other side, you get the five Gokaija Ranger keys, which I'm probably going to have to scan that and make that my phone background. So <laughs> I will do that. And on the back, we have kind of just showing it on the stand, the new buttons that it's added for the voice phrases and the, uh, the songs, and then the five Gokaija Ranger keys that you get with this thing. This is the real scary part because of the fact that there's been a bunch of defects on it. And I'm really terrified that mine is going to have defects on it. Some perfectly fine. So here's the moment of truth. We're about to find out. All right. I think I got both the flaps. So the bottom tray here is the stand, which looks very nice. So it looks like there's just a tiny bit of assembly we got to do with that. So we have the big Go Kydra logo. So I'll just go ahead and punch these out of their big plastic prisons. So very nice reflective plastic and everything, very shiny. 
It's a very pretty Gokaidra logo. And then the stand is just going to clip in basically right there. So, yeah, just like that. It has, like, a little bracer in the back. And uh, that would be the stand for the Mobirates. I don't think that it works with the older one. We'll test it, though. Because here's the older one. And I don't think it can clip in. I mean, it can rest there. But I think the newer one actually has, like, a clip for it. So, But it can rest on that if you really wanted to do that for whatever reason. But, of course, the actual thing we care about is the Mobirates itself. So... Here it is in the tray. You get all five of the Gokaiju Ranger keys in there, which all look to be the boxes trying to fall over there in the corner. But I will say, from just cautionary glances on the back of it inside of here, it doesn't look to be covered in weird white powder. So let's go ahead and carefully take the tray off. This is the part I'm most terrified about, so I'm not even going to do it in the review station because I don't want anything to fall over. All right. Doesn't look like it's covered in any weird stuff, <laughs> so <laughs> or weird fingerprints or anything like that. It's so pretty. I mean, it's exactly what you think it would be. It's just the regular Mobirates, but a little fancier, a little different. As you can see here, we have two new buttons here on the side, which will be a bunch of voice phrases and songs and everything. These are buttons now, the uh, red and green buttons on the top and the pound sign and whatever that is there in the corner. Those are functional buttons now. Ooh, that's got a good click to it. Uh, that's like a different kind of click than I'm uh, used to on a Mobirates. So I will say it is strange. Of course, you can see how cold it is. I'm kind of like, you know, leaving marks on it with my own hand. But yeah, I don't see any weird white powder or anything like that. That's a new hinge. That's definitely a new hinge. So I, I'm very familiar with Mobirates from flipping them over, flipping them, you know, open all the time, uh, which I'm not going to do with this thing. <laughs> but you can definitely uh, feel the difference between the original release and the new one. But look how, oh, just look how pretty it is compared to the older one. So you can see here. They covered all the screw holes that were present on the original 2011 release on the insides, which, yeah, that's definitely a different kind of hinge. Interesting. But yeah, the insides, they changed the Ranger key slot slightly. So instead of having the gray plastic inside, it's all black in there now. Also, you can see mine has a little bit of paint wear on the older one, which is obviously not there because this is brand new. These were nothing. These were just hard, solid plastic. Those four buttons, these were all pressable, but now they're all pressable. Uh, one of the biggest differences is on the back because uh, the back you have a bunch of Bandai copyright information and a like gray plastic for the screw cover and you have an on and off switch and on the back the battery compartment's in the same area but the on and off switch is gone and all of the copyright information is gone so how do you open this toy you might ask i don't exactly get it i mean <laughs> it's really strange the on and off switch is behind the battery compartment so we're gonna have to go ahead and open this thing up and we're gonna have to put batteries in it and then turn it on which would be we're gonna have to open it up to turn it on anyway so let's go ahead and do that so obviously it just takes the pretty typical Toku toys of triple A's or double A's or whatever these are and turn it on. Well, that sounds like I'm a buyer. It's all right. So let's go ahead and put the battery cover back on. Ooh. It's definitely got a lot of noise to it. So there's the button to switch the modes. So Navi will do all the mode switching and everything, and we have a lot of different modes in this thing. So that's really cool. <sighs> Good stuff. All right. So then we have all the voice phrases and music. <laughs> oh my god. My favorite. My absolute favorite right here. So this is definitely a weird feature there. So this is supposed to be like a you're moving the wires around and you're like getting ready to put a key in there. It's definitely a weird choice for that button, but uh, it's cool nonetheless. So yeah, we have all these voice phrases on these buttons when we go into the henshin mode. So of course, Marvelous is number one. Oh, 
And I know guy phrases there, but I know guy is included in one of the roll call sounds in here. But, uh, oh yeah, good stuff there. Yes! Oh my god. If you're a Gokaiju fan, by the way, you absolutely need this thing. I know it's very pricey, but, uh, yeah, I mean, let's just examine it here again. Make sure there's nothing wrong with it. But, uh, you know, aesthetically, it looks completely fine on mine. Thank God. <laughs> All right. So, of course, I... So we got to check out these guys here. The brand new... Memor Ooh, that's a different kind of click. I know my Ranger Key clicks, that's for sure. And that is a different kind of click. So this is the Gokai Red Ranger Key from the Memorial Edition set. So obviously it's a little, I mean, it's painted the same as the original key, but of course this one is a brand new key. So it's going to look a little cleaner, especially with the Gokai Jir symbol on the helmet and everything. And I think the chest symbol is definitely bigger on the Memorial one, which is probably more show accurate. So that is cool. But uh, basically the whole gimmick with these ones is that they have an auto flip feature now with this little button. Ooh, that's good. All right. So you got to, ooh. I have my finger on it. All right, so you got to give it a tiny little bit of force, but you're probably going to want to do it with this finger more than anything else. So it's right there on the side. So you just kind of have to push it in and the key will flip. So you can also see here that the plastic is like this nice kind of, uh, not shiny, but it's not like the dull gray kind of plastic that we had on the original keys or anything like that. It's a little bit more shinier. And on the back, the key is the same exact cut as the original key, but there is no more R001 written there. So it's... Uh, basically the same exact key but it is a little little bit different so we'll go ahead and turn this into key mode and yeah you can see the key pieces are the same the keys are the same size so they will still work pretty much every single key from the original toy line does work in the memorial of Pirates. but of course without further ado let's go ahead and do it i think as close as correct as i can not like that Ooh, that's good stuff right there. We'll go ahead and move this tray out of the way here. Um, like I said, this is not the review, and we're going to wrap this up here very quickly here. But I will just kind of briefly take a little gander at this thing, because I know the inside of it is very pretty. So here is the instruction manual for the Mobirates. Ooh, okay. Yeah, it's very nice paper quality and everything. So it shows you how to use a key and everything if you don't know how to do that. So it shows you the different modes, which I'll kind of get into this, you know, as we, uh, as I do the actual review of it, I'll, I'll kind of look at it in more detail. You get this gorgeous photo of the Gokaiders down there and hey, look, that's how you put a Ranger key inside and all that stuff. And that's how you close it and all that. So, <laughs> and all this, and a bunch of sounds you can get in. Let's Otakara Navigate, or whatever Navi says. So that's pretty cool. And the really nice Gokaiju logo back there. So I do want to show it off. So here is the original Mobarex, which does have batteries in it. Uh, the Legend one, which is sitting over there in the corner, does not have batteries in it. So I'm not going to be able to demonstrate this as well uh, with that one. But here is the new key with the old phone. So on the older toy, when you did this, 0414, it did that forever. So I want to test to see if special mode works on here. So 0414, it does not. So special mode does not work on here. However, you know what does work on here? The numbers for the teams we don't have keys for yet, or technically we do now, but didn't before. So here we go. Obviously, you know GoBusters is going to work. Which does sound a little bit different than it does in the Legend of Pirates, but here's the ones that I really, really care about.
Yes! Yes! All right. And then, of course, Don Brothers. That's a nope. All right, so I guess we're not getting Don Brothers of Ranger Keys. Or if we do, they're not going to work in this thing. But, I mean, that's basically all I'm going to cover with it here today. It's pretty sweet. I like it a lot. And I'm glad that mine is not bad. At least seemingly so. All right, and uh, that's pretty much everything I'm going to go ahead and cover here with the Memorial Mobirates. And I love this thing a lot. A lot. <laughs> so, like I said, be sure to stay tuned for Monday when I'm actually going to have my full review of this thing. I also got to make sure that all the sounds do work correctly because I want to make sure I check all the keys and everything uh, since I do have all of the reds before and I am getting the Memorial Red set, but it's just not here yet. I want to double check it. So far, so good, it looks like. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video to get my raw emotions of this toy that's very, 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 very important to me. And I hope you guys are able to get one yourselves or if you are getting one, uh, I would love to hear if yours is good. I hope yours is good. Uh, just like mine seemingly is because it would be a real shame if it isn't. And huge, huge thanks to Toe Collectibles for having this up on their site and allowing me to get something that is really like oh, going to be like a holy grail item for me. It's going to be something that I treasure for a very long time. It means a lot to me that this is a thing that exists and it's like the definitive version of this that you could possibly get. And I love this thing and I'm not going to have as many kind words to say about the Memorial Red set when that does come in. But be sure to stay tuned for all of it and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So thank you all so much for watching. And of course, until next time, you can follow me on Twitter at LiveRangerKey or at Lightning PR. And I'll see you all later. Go Kai Change. Let's play some dominoes now.